The Imo State Chapter of the All Progressives Congress has conducted its primary election for the Imo North Senatorial District by election through the direct mode of primaries. At the end of the exercise, two parallel results emerged. Ifani Araume emerged winner of one of the APC factions, scoring 22,944 votes, as declared by member of the APC Primary Election Committee, Umagana while Frank Ibizim emerged winner of the other APC faction with 13,637 votes as declared by the chairman of the primary election committee, Senator Surajdin Bashir. Plus, CV Africa monitored the election across the six local government areas and 64 wards in the Imo North Senatorial District, uh, says the election was peaceful and smooth in all places visited. Uh, having satisfied the requirement of the law, and uh, the power confer on us as a member from the national headquarters to come and conduct this primary. I'm here to declare Senator Godwin Ifai Ararome having scored the highest number of votes is here to 22,944 is here by declare the winner. <laughs> Tested in the election alleged illegalities in the entire process. The aspirants vowed that any plan to impose candidates on the people of Imo North Senatorial District will be resisted. There is a lot of subterfuge, there's a lot of uh, criminality in the exercise. Because you remember about a week ago or so, somebody claimed that he was the party's uh, consensus candidate. And then the next day, the party refuted it. Then now, yesterday, they called us again to try and see whether we can have a consensus arrangement. While we were there, a uh, commissioner in the state was uh, going around telling people all over the place that we have chosen the same person as a consensus candidate. That, as a matter of fact, what they told us, the committee that spoke to us told us that he's the president's choice. Since the inception of Buhari's administration, he has never picked anybody. That I am very sure of. He has always told people to go and subject themselves to the electorate. My word is peaceful, and I haven't seen the, the supposed anointed uh, candidates here and everywhere else, except where they have managed to arrange people, you know. And if you're going to be a candidate to face other candidates in a general election, you better have grassroots support. You, you understand. You don't call us parents together and then tell them that the president asked you to nominate somebody else when we know it's not true. Uh, the leader of the party does not interfere. He did not anoint anybody. He wants grassroots support because he wants the party to win in any general election.